Turk spaceship. I love it though. <laughs> if you want to go all out this new year, this is the dress you will need. So I'm doing thriller. Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be doing a what to wear for New Year's Eve. So New Year's Eve is always a tricky one. You don't want to look too overdressed, but you still want to look special because it's a special occasion. You know, you're going into the new year feeling like your best you. You want to turn up looking your best. Which so I've got lots of different op outfit options for you, which are all very affordable. I don't think there's anything like over 50 pound but I will double check that for you. Anyway, everything will be linked down below in the description box. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm Katie. Please make sure that you leave me a comment down below just to say hello, as I love hearing from you all. If you enjoyed this video, then please make sure you click the thumbs up button and also just subscribe because, because why wouldn't you? Life's too short not to just do things you enjoy and be sporadic and spare the moment. Boom, hit that button. And... That's it, let's just get straight into it today. So to start off, I've gone for something quite sleek and se sexy and simple, but still quite elegant. So I would say obviously this needs an iron and you have to excuse these because they come on all of the items that I've got. But apart from that, we're just gonna show you the first one and see what you think. Okay, so this dress that I'm wearing at the minute is the Rose Strappy Satin Carol Midi Dress, which is in a size 12. Um, and it has got adjustable straps which I think is very helpful for the cowl neck. I really like how it sits here. I think maybe when it's had an iron, it will sit better. Um, and this one was 25 pounds. So I do think it's a little expensive for the quality of the dress. It's not even double lined. I think a double line would have like hidden a multitude of sins, um, as they say. If you wanted to wear sort of like a pull me in underneath, you probably couldn't because of the high split in the leg, but other than that, it is quite a pretty colour. And I think maybe with a tan, it would look a little bit better as so some of the more of an olive skin tone. Now, this bag was actually as much as the dress, but I'm a little bit in love with it. And I just think it just finishes off. I mean, if you're only going to spend £25 on a dress, spending £25 on a handbag isn't horrendous because it's just so pretty. Like, I think that's the most elegant, beautiful handbag. I've ever possibly seen in my whole life. It's just like, if I was a handbag, I'd be made of this sparkly pink with a nice rose gold handle strap. It's just pure, pure bag perfection. Little rose gold earrings, and then obviously finish off with your rose gold shoes. Perfection. So this next dress was 30 pounds, and this is the silk wrap dress. Now I feel like this is literally like, a little bit of cloth material. <laughs> it also like protrudes quite a lot here. I feel like they could have done with like one little more stitch just to hold it all together. However, on, it does look very nice and very classy. However, I do in real life feel like I'm wearing a little bit of an like a nighty or some sort of sexy pajamas, I don't know. So again, I got this one in a size 12 and the fit is absolutely lovely. If anything, the arms are a little bit big, but everywhere else, obviously with an iron, it fits absolutely lovely. Um, for us tall girls, it's quite short, but not uncomfortably short. So, you know, we could get away with this one on New Year's Eve, it's fine. But I think for 30 pound, it's a little, little bit steep, to be honest. So this next dress I have to show you, I'm actually a little bit in love with. It's super sexy, super like slinky, and just fits like a dream. It was 30 pounds, and it's called the Black Satin Bustier Lace Insert Midi Dress. And this is like the dress of dreams for me. It literally is just like so soft and silky. And like compare this £30 to the last £30 dress that I just had on. There's no comparison really because this actually fits. This like has some structure to it. And it's just like everything you could want and more in a dress. I, I literally love it. They had this in red but I think that's a little... A little too sexy, if you ask me. Okay, so we're just getting away from the slightly sexy. Like, that was a bit sexy. And now we're going to try and get a little bit more glitzy. So a little bit more glamour. Now you have to excuse what they have on under here. Because this is actually completely... Completely see-through. Like, I don't know what you're meant to wear under this. So they didn't send me anything to wear underneath it. But you can absolutely see everything. So all I've done is put a white strappy top underneath it. 
Um, I'm just going to have to show you this one because I don't really know what to say about it. It's such a shame because it would be such a nice little number. Like the material is quite cute. The material is pretty. Look how lovely that is. Like really, really, really pretty. But what the hell are you meant to wear under it? Like this obviously looks shit. But I don't know what, what you're meant to wear under it. Like I've, this came separately to it and I just think you let me down here pretty little thing. You've let me down. Let me tell you how much it is. This one, if this is more than 25, I'm going to go ape. 25. I need, to, I need to know how she wears this. Look how flawless that looks. This is see through. What has she possibly got on under there that you cannot see through? I got this in a size 12 as well, and it's, it's quite short. Quite short, guys. Are you ready for the return? of the animal print. I actually like this. Like I pulled it out of the bag and I was like, nah honey, that ain't gonna look good. But, safe to say, it's growing on me. I've been looking for long sleeve, like smart tops for a while, like pretty little blouses, little shirts, because I don't really like a collar on me. I don't know why, I don't know why, I don't know why it is. I just feel like they're all a bit like, even though I love, a roll neck jumper, but I feel like collars are all a bit like up in my grill. Like we get a bit nelly up in my grill on us. This top, I am really, really enjoying. Really enjoying. I don't know what it is. I feel a little bit like my nan in it. I bet my nan would have worn this. Bless her little cotton socks. But these trousers, <laughs> they are not comfy. So these are obviously like pretend faux leather trousers and they're from the shape collection like i said the shape black matte pu leggings and they're 18 pound and the top was reduced down to 17.50 and i got this in a size 8 so it was originally 25 pound but i did have 30 percent off and it's the brown snake print oversized shirt as i said before everything will be linked down below any weird noises that's these trousers okay <laughs> okay so I don't know if you can see the colour this is coming up. So this is an emerald green. Yes, it's very low, ladies. Very, very low. So you have to be comfortable with having this amount of skin out. Um, I would say a tan would look really nice right now. Because I think because it's so dark, it's just making me look even whiter. So this is like a velvet, long, elegant dress. This is maybe more if you're going somewhere a little bit more fancy, a little bit more... I don't know, maybe an event in London or something like that and you need to look a little bit more black tie style but you still want to look quite sexy. So you quite like this. It's very sexy. Okay, I feel like this is all a bit sexy. But, you know, it's New Year's, why not? I mean, the fit is absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. This one I got in a size 12 and this one was only £25 as well. So when you think of like how much dress you get for this, that's £25 well spent and it looks like a lot more in real life. It's very fitted, it's very structured, it's really, really pretty. And I think you could wear a lovely long necklace or maybe some perhaps, not this colour, but some quite prominent earrings. I think bigger than this probably would just, just finish this outfit off with a lovely little elegant handbag. Wow. You would be a showstopper. You'd be a fire popper. A, a Christmas cracker, a firework popping exciting thing. <laughs> okay, you guys, I think I found dress perfection. Dress perfection. This is even like this could be for Christmas Day. If you go quite glam on Christmas Day, this could be Christmas Day, day dress because oh, I can't get the proper colour on the screen. It's like a really nice like forest green it's sexy it's slick it's elegant it's classy it's warm you can wear some tights and little heeled boots or we could wear it on new year's eve with some little heels like how this dress is perfection this is like christmas dress perfection i love this one absolutely love it fits like a dream Okay guys, this was the cheapest dress as well. This was £17.50. This is actually dress perfection. I'm sure this came in like a red colour and a few other colours as well. And it's just perfect. So you could wear this, honestly, I think, perfectly on Christmas Day. Tight heel boots, lovely or very classy New Year's Eve. Some little bit of sparkle on the earrings, a little sparkle on the handbag. 
you know, we're feeling the Christmas vibes here. It's Jingle Bell all the way. I love it. I can't fault it. Right, and obviously, as it's me, I've saved the best to last. Are you ready? Whew. For Mrs. Sparkles. If you want to go all out this new year, this is the dress you will need. And I will also put a picture here of a jumpsuit they have. So if you want to go more than this, this is even more than this. Like, are you ready? Are you ready? It's a little bit big for me, so I'd have to go down a size. But, oh my god, I feel like a spaceship. I love it though. <laughs> is this not festive dress perfection? Look how sparkly it is. Interesting. Interesting. Do you feel like a spaceman? Or do you feel like a glitter bauble, like of the disco queen world? Because I feel like a glitter bauble. What are they called? No, disco ball. So, I mean, this is all out. New Year's sparkle the shit out of life. Do you want to sparkle? I mean, I think it's cute. The arms, I think, are on camera coming up a little strange. <laughs> but in real life, it looks really cool. It looks really pretty. I think it is just a little bit big. That's the only problem. It's just a little bit big. This one was £40 and it's a size 12, so I'd probably go down a size um, if you're thinking of getting this. And like I said, they have a jumpsuit, which is like all this material. Look at that little baby. So you guys, that's it. That is the end. Just watch the mirror. That is the end of my New Year's what to wear outfit style guide. Let me know down below which dress is your favourite as well. So if you enjoyed watching this video then please remember to click the subscribe button. Feel like it's this side. Um, and also make sure you give the video a thumbs up. Thank you so much for being here and I'll see you in the next video. I also hope that you all have a very happy new year and make lots of resolutions that you actually plan on sticking to. So something that you would make a resolution for tomorrow, not just in the new year. So be the best, be the best you as you can be. And that's all I ask for. Happy new year.